Welcome back to part two. Now I've got my prints here that I completed in part one. Very messy, very grungy, organic prints. Now I'm going to make a journal page for, again, my very organic, very messy journal. I've cut some pages out of a piece of craft here. It doesn't matter, it can be out, out of anything. Or you could just do this in your regular journal, it's fine. And I've got things out in front of me that I might use. I don't know quite what I'm going to do yet. Um, I've got stencils, anything to add more colour, soft pastels, oil pastels, um, anything for a little bit of mark making, bits of washi tape, rubber stamps, anything at all that you think you might use on a journal page. And now I'm going to cut some pages just to fit on my craft cardstock. I've cut some pieces to fit and now I can start to have a play about with these backgrounds. This is a stencil by Carabelle Studio. Got lots of nice little interesting bits to pick from on here. So at the moment I'm only using colours that I've already got in the background. So there's nothing new going on at the moment. I'm going to be really bold with some black now. I'm using my Stabilo Woodies now just to add some marks to the page. I'm being deliberately very loose and untidy with it. I'm adding a little bit of texture stamping with this set by Carabelle Studio. It's a good way just to fill in any gaps Again, I'm not introducing new colours, this is just reds because I've got a lot of reds in the background. And the white pen. Now this is a good way to tidy things up, highlight things, just even add some scribbling. And Stabilo pencil, great for adding some really nice bold black marks. I think I'm going to add my strip down here. I've also got some nice um, black and white washi tape. I might bring some of that in too. Before I stick these bits down I'm going to add a little bit of, um, this is like easy metal, metal leaf, looks a bit like gold leaf. If you haven't got this you could just use a little bit of um, metallic paint if you want to add a little bit of bling to your page. I did some stitching onto mine just you know because I always do but that's always optional and I've got my quotes here I've actually typed my journaling and then that page is ready to add inside my signature
I have my two completed pages side by side in my little signature ready to go inside my uh, loose leaf kind of junk journal. I've also got these two pages not yet finished but they will sit in there ready for me to play when I'm ready and then that will all fit inside along with the rest of my messy pages. I can't tell you how much fun it is just playing along like this, using your hands, not having any kind of purpose or end goal, just art for art's sake. It's very therapeutic, it's a huge amount of fun. I hope you've enjoyed playing along. See you next time.